Welcome everybody to another edition of Georgia Archery's Week in Review. I'm your host, Big John Chandler. This is where we talk about anything and everything to do with archery in the state of Georgia and Georgia archers, wherever they may shoot. Well, what happened this past weekend? Well, we had Georgia shooting in Florida, we had Georgia shooting in Kentucky, and we had Georgia shooting in Georgia. So we had lots of fun. Let's get right to it. First off, let's talk about Kentucky. ASA Pro-Am in Kentucky, and there was a bunch of Georgians there, and a bunch of Georgians made the trip. It was a record number of shooters. Congratulations to everybody who went. Here's a few pictures. As you can see, we had some uh, Georgians on the podium, so congratulations, guys. All right, well, let's go down to Florida. And there was uh, the Gator Cup. And those guys shot, and they had a record number of people shooting there. And we had a lot of Georgians. And uh, we had some make the podium. Congratulations, guys. Here's a few pictures. Well, on Saturday, if you wasn't in Kentucky and you wasn't in Florida, you were probably shooting 3D at the Christian Bow Hunters. There was about 47 shooters, and here's a few pictures.
Well, you can find this information and everything else we post on our website, www.georgiaarchery.com. Throughout the week, we post all kinds of updates on our Facebook page. That's Facebook slash Georgia Archery. You can find this video, other review videos, and different things on our YouTube channel. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. And if you have a, something you want me to talk about on the show, send me an email. That's GeorgiaArchery at gmail.com. There's a few people trying to get the Roswell Parks and Recreation to put in archery as a sport for the recreation department. And there's a partition to sign. So if you'll uh, go to this uh, link, it'll also be below uh, in this post, and uh, sign the partition to see if they can get enough signatures to uh, get it started. Also, if you're a youth, the GAA Joad, State Joad is coming up. You need to get your registrations in. So go on and get your registrations in. If you're a 4-H team, you can shoot at this too. So uh, find the registrations. I'll have a link below. Well, what's coming up this weekend? There is a lot of, lot of, lot of shooting going on. You uh, should be able to get out and shoot as long as the weather holds out. For you 3D or soul hunters will be doing their thing for two days. Well, on Saturday, High Lonesome has a shoot. Banks County is holding the third leg of the North Georgia circuit. Hillsman's is holding a shoot. The uh, Wounded Warriors, and uh, I tell you what, they got a, a, about $5,000 worth of raffle prizes. So go out there and raise some money for the Wounded Warriors. Also, Buckeye and Ace is putting on a memorial shoot for Papa Joe. And to round out Saturday, 323 Archery is having a shoot. Well, on Sunday, the Angel Archery Club is holding a qualifier, and DS Archery is on the list. Redneck Archery Club is doing it again. Destiny Farms is on the list. And Satilia River Archery Club. So uh, if there's not a shoot close to you, you don't live in the state of Georgia. So get out there and sling some arrows. Be sure to take someone and teach them how to shoot a bow. It'll last them a lifetime. Let's grow this sport and make it bigger. As you can see with the numbers that they're having in different shoots, this archery is growing across the nation. And uh, let's make sure Georgia is growing just as well. Well, that's it for this week. Until next time, I'm Big John, and we'll see you.